I don't know, True Tan. Hey, man, I came to talk to the, the ladies, man. You're a good woman. I want to tell good women something, man. Stop confusing good guys with the bad guys. That's what make y'all lost in the sauce, man. Like, I want I want y'all to really understand. There's a lot of good dudes out here who want to be there for you, who want to be there, who want to be there to heal you, who want to show you the love that you deserve, who want to help you get through your traumatic times of what you used to be through the abusive shit the relationships you have multiple went through every dude that you probably been with was nothing but a cheater nothing but a liar dude wasn't honest always hid shit from you always ran and sometimes us as good guys gotta understand what you've been through but also you gotta have an open mind and realize too ladies man you gotta stop choosing these type of particular guys. There's a lot of great women out here. That's why I tell y'all, keep y'all legs closed, man. You don't have to have sex with every dude, especially if they're not deserving of it. It's a lot of good women out here, bro. A lot of black women, this is for black women, really. It's a lot of good women out here, man. I want y'all to understand, bro. That video that I made was for the women who want nothing but money and, and shit that don't shit that don't make sense, bro. At the end of the day, you can you can want everything in the motherfucking world when it comes to a man, when it comes to the man or whatever the fuck life gives you. But you gotta also understand that you have to deal with yourself in these type of particular categories. Love starts within you first, ladies. And you can't love no man if you don't love yourself. Stop confusing good guys with the bad ones because when you do that, you start making yourself feel like that. It's not no good guys around and men just ain't shit, but it's really the man that you're choosing. The end of the day, bro, I tell women, man, I love all y'all. I love all black women. I just know the ones who are queens, that word is being used too loosely in kings. You dig what I'm saying? The ones who queens are understand the worth. They understand their worth. They understand they, they understand their beauty when they're natural. They don't put on wigs. They don't do shirts. They don't put on makeup. They don't try to fit in with the crowd. Them are the women. Them are women. Them are women who know they self. They skin when they walk into the room. You got you to gotta want a woman off of how the world perceives her. Like when you when she walk in the room, what type of energy do she give to the men? Like give to the men and give to the women. Like what type of energy do she give? You gotta want that. Them the type of that them the type of women, fellas, you need to start looking for. It's always good women, man. It's always good women out here. You're a good woman. You just have a lot of a lot of problems you need help with, and that comes with inner self. You gotta treat yourself as peace, harmony, and faith matters. You have to treat yourself as peace, harmony, and faith matters, man. You gotta understand you can't Another thing about relationships, bro, with women, you have to watch the type of friends that you should hang yourself around because a lot of motherfuckers will give you bad advice, not even knowing who, who this guy is, but this can be the good guy, the good guy that want to be with you, but they don't want to see you in a happy relationship, so they rather you go back to the motherfucker that was causing you damage and trauma and caused you more hurt, then that leads you to be a broken soul. See... The worst thing you could do is love a damaged person. I start to understand that too. Ladies, this to go both ways. This for men and women. You dig what I'm saying? The worst thing you could do is love a damaged person. And women, it's a lot of good women out here. You are a good woman, man. You just need to you need to put in the work to heal yourself. Like I tell people, bro, every broken heart can be healed, man. You just have to want to heal that broken heart. And you just have to understand what comes with healing that broken heart. You have to want to wake up and put the work in and say, I want to be in a healthy relationship. I want it, I want my kids to be healthy around their father. I want to not feel like I'm just in a big-ass puddle or nothing. Like I want to feel like I'm something versus a, a nigga treating me like I'm not anything. Sometimes, like I say, men, men got to hold accountability for what we do because at the end of the day, bro, a lot of us get a lot of bum bitches pregnant, bro. And a lot of us... Uh, a try to treat a good woman she'll deal with enough as it is she may be such of a good woman to where she dealing with the past traumas that i'm going through with my other baby mama and shit like that and that caused her to deal with confliction and and, and, and be depressed and deal with shit too like see i tell people you got to look at it from a, a two-way street not just one both of y'all feelings matter in a relationship it's not just yours man the worst causing of a relationship, bro, the fucked up part that ends marriages and shit like that, bro, ladies, I want y'all to understand it's pride, man. A lot of y'all be so prideful, even dudes, like a lot of us be so proud to where we don't want to apologize about what we do. And that's what never, that's what stops our happiness. That's what stops our success in marriage. That's what stops our success. See, I'm going to tell one thing. I'm going to tell y'all ladies one thing about marriage. Ain't nobody ready for marriage until you honestly in that situation. Ain't nobody ready for marriage, bro. Until you are really honestly ready for that situation. You're in that situation and ready for it. A motherfucker can't be ready for something they ain't into.
regardless, bro. See, everybody has flaws about them, bro. Like, ladies, it may be a good dude that's out there who may who may have done something to you, but at the end of the day, he can take accountability for what he's done. But you also have to be willing to forgive. I tell me, I tell when you are a good woman. I tell women this all the time, bro. You got to understand what comes with being married. You got to learn how to forgive and deal with them ups and downs, man. You gotta learn what this shit is about. You gotta be, you gotta stop being vacant in your own mind and start realizing y'all have children. Y'all have things y'all have to work out, but if y'all willing to grow through that, bro, nigga, Ice Cube was married for 32 years, bro. You don't think they had ups and downs, bro? They had plenty of them motherfuckers, bro. Shit, who the fuck else? Uh, I just seen Nia Long got cheated. She got cheated on, but I know they was married for a long time, but see, that's a, that's a guy who don't appreciate what he had versus what what he wanted like that 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 come from a guy who wanted something versus not appreciating what he had you get what i'm saying a lot of these guys a lot of women get married to the wrong guys and be in relationships with the wrong guys because they never cared about their worth as it is a lot of dudes are mentally and physically hurt within themselves so they'll try to hurt you and put you down with them man. you are a good woman you just need to understand patience man you just gotta heal your heart. You gotta move forward. You gotta understand, bro, that every man that you are with is not an enemy. You gotta start weeing the bad with the good. You gotta stop trying to go for these good, these bad guys, man, and start going for the dudes who honestly care about you. Because a man who care about your feelings, bro, is gonna be the one that's sticking around the longest. Because then what you don't understand is when you pushing, women fella realize when you're pushing, when you're pushing a good man away, that's on your own turn. He not just pushing his, he not just moving away from you. You pushing him away. And you can't expect a good man to stay and keep feeling like he's not getting the love that he deserves and, and you and you feel like you're not getting the love that you deserve. But in reality, that's because you stuck in your own head. You think everything's supposed to be your way. You want to just A, A, B, C, and D and not his way either. You get what I'm saying, bro? Love is a two-way street, not just one, bro. A person can love you and lose they self not noticing that you're not loving them the way they want to be loved. Ladies, man, you are, a lot of y'all are good women, man. Y'all just need help, man. And y'all have to acknowledge the fact that y'all need help. And y'all have to understand, though, everything is not just about you. Keep your legs closed. Quit giving sex to just any man out here, man. Stop being so, stop being so oblivious to the fact that a lot of these dudes, man, that have sex with multiple women and bring, bring nasty diseases back to you. They don't, they don't care for you if they, they willing to have sex with women throughout the day and come back and bring new type of shits back to you, bro. Like, come on, man, you gotta understand. And also, you know, a lot of y'all know what type of guys y'all be dealing with, man, but y'all choose to still deal with them. It's like y'all want y'all heart to be fractured. Y'all want y'all heart to feel like that pound that's bleeding inside. Y'all want y'all heart to be vacant, bro. It's not... Like, like I tell, man, I tell, I tell dudes too, bro, like, pretty faces, man, don't mean shit. When you look inside of a woman, bro, see how her heart really is, bro. And that's a lot of y'all, man. A lot of y'all smile out on the outside, bro, but in the inside, y'all really are hurting deeply. Y'all bleeding inside. Y'all crying out for help, but y'all don't know how to have communication to say y'all crying for it. Y'all wanna, y'all wanna find a way to be frustrated about every little thing, bro. Life is not about, life is not about the materialistic. When you love somebody, bro, Love is all this world need, bro. We we all need love, man. Black women and black men. Like, we all need love, bro. We all need it, bro. It's a lot of great women out here. You are a good woman, bro. You just need to learn how to heal yourself and understand, bro. Everything takes patience and everything needs faith. And pride is not the best way to always move when it comes to a relationship. Because what, because what you don't understand is when you leave that marriage or you leave that person or you or that, that honestly love you and you having kids bomb and shit like that, bro, and you literally are in a committed relationship with that person, that person who honestly love you. I'm not talking about a bad, a fucked up dude who put his hands on you or none of that. I'm talking by the guy who honestly there and you don't know how and his feelings hurt you're not even acknowledging the fact that his feelings hurt you're only acknowledging the fact that yours hurt the fucked up part about it is that y'all can't have a conversation and talk about what happened a lot of us make decisions on how we feeling in the moment and not understanding that we really still miss that person or we really should have had a better conversation me and this person may be having a kid or me and this person got a kid and we still love each other and he was he, he may not be perfect but i know for a fact that he can change a lot of shit about himself he may made mistakes i tell woman but if you're a good woman man you will forgive bro you will understand that every everybody has their days of when they going through something and they may do something and it ain't on purpose it's just certain shit that happened like you and, and, and that's where y'all get lost in the sauce that stop trying to compare another guy to a dude that he's not if he's a good guy don't try to tempt his character and being something that he not especially because there's some men out here that tell you who they is bro and they literally upfront honest with you you have to 
understand the rules of being a real woman and knowing that you're a real woman. And when you know that you're a real woman, life can change for you. Peace. Follow me at Actual Truth on the Follow me at TG.True. Like, comment, subscribe to Actual Truth. Peace.